Namaste. Hello. How is everybody? I hope everyone is fine. Today I'm going to share with you some tips uh, on how to do the Surya Namaskar A and B in Ashtanga series. This is especially for the beginners and intermediate who find it very difficult and challenging to do Ashtanga. They don't know how to start. You know, uh, normally we start with the Surya Namaskar A and B for they are our warm-ups. Um, okay, uh, I will start with the beginner and then I will start with the intermediate. These two I will do in English and then I will do the portion that I normally do for my practice where I'll be using uh, Sanskrit as well. Yeah? So uh, let's get started by standing up in Samasthiti. So stand on top of the mat. Samasthiti means you just stand on top, feet together, hands at the side. Okay, so from here, I will be using English only. Okay, so feet together. And then from here, don't tilt the tailbone up. Just neutral. Everything is neutral. Inhale, this is Samastitihi. Samastitihi means standing uh, feet together, hands at the side. Your tailbone, no tilting up, but basically neutral. I will start with Surya Namaskar A. Okay, now from here, inhale. Hands up. Exhale, fall forward. Okay, from here, for beginners normally, they will find that hamstrings are too tight. So what you need to do, just bend the knees so your tummy touch the thigh. Now, once you are okay, start trying to make your feet, your, your, your um, knees a little bit straight. You know, try a little bit. Now, from here, there's no need for you to jump back, but walk back and go to the plank. Plank is, um, remember, body straight, your shoulders over the wrist. Now, from here, drop to the knees. Still tucking the toes and you go to half chaturanga. Lean forward. Here, you feel a lot on the, your arms. Inhale, upward. Okay, see, my, my, my toes are still tucked. Exhale, downward facing dog. Okay, now from here, gaze towards your navel. Five breaths. One, two, three, four, five. Look to the front, one step or two step to the front, your right foot and left foot. Exhale down. Inhale, hands up, reaching up and Samastiti. Surya Namaskar B. Okay, here bend the knees. Tap the, to, uh, the, the floor with your fingers and reach up. If you cannot reach your hands together, cannot put your palms together, put it apart, it's okay. Exhale down. Inhale, look up. And again, walk back. Do the plank. Drop to the knees. And half Chaturanga. Inhale upward. Exhale downward facing down. Now from here, turn your left foot 45 degrees, your right foot in the front, in between your hands. Warrior one. Your right foot 90 degrees. And Plank. Drop to the knees. Again, half chaturanga. Inhale. Exhale. Downward facing dog. Turn your right foot. 45. 
your left foot in between your hands. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, plank. Drop to the knees, half chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing. Exhale, downward facing. Stay here for five breaths. Again, gaze towards your navel. One, two, three, four, five. Look up and put your right foot in the front, in between your hands, left foot in the front. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, chair push. Again, you can put your hands apart slightly and stand up straight. Samastiti here. See, not too difficult. You can start with this, practice this one, maybe a couple of months, it depends on you. And then, now, I'm going to show you for intermediate. We start with Surya Namaskar A as well. Okay, A, go inhale. Exhale down. Okay, I'm sure by now your hamstring should be more or less okay. So you can bend slightly, micro bend is alright. If you feel that you still need to micro bend, micro bend, make sure that your back is straight. Inhale, look up. This time you can jump uh, to plank. A little hop. Just Bend the knee and go to plank. And from here again, you have option to go to um, half chaturanga or full chaturanga. So um, here I will show you half chaturanga and the Surya Namaskar B, I'll show you full chaturanga. So from here, you bend the knees, drop to the knees, then flex the toes. Half chaturanga. Inhale upward, exhale downward facing dog. Five breaths one, two, three, four, and five. Look to the front, bend the knees, and hop. Exhale down. Inhale, hands up, reach up, Samastiti. Surya Namaskar B. Same thing, tapping the floor with your fingers and try to reach your hands, your palms together. Exhale down. Inhale, look up. Okay, position your fingers, your hands, your palms, spreading out your fingers. Now, jump back to plank. This time, I'll go straight to Chaturanga. So from here, Chaturanga. Inhale upward. Exhale, downward facing dog. Right foot in between your hands. Warrior one. Come to the plank. Again, full chaturanga. Inhale upward. Exhale. Downward facing dog. Left leg in between your hands. Plank. Chaturanga. Inhale upward, exhale, downward facing dog. Five breath, gaze towards your navel. One, two, three, four, five. Look to the front, 
Bend the knees and hop. Jump. Very gently landing on the on your feet. And exhale. Inhale. Chair pose. And samasthiti. So you these are the for um, beginners and also for the intermediate. I will show you the um, practice that I normally do. Then I can share with you. So once you have done the beginners and the intermediate, you can go, you can try to do a little bit more floating to the advanced uh, level. Yeah. So from here, some acidity I'll be doing in Sanskrit. A girl inhale. Look up. Do a exhale. Trini inhale. Chaturi back. Pancha inhale. Shut. Exhale. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Look to the front. Sakta. Ashta. Exhale. Nava inhale. Samastiti. Sura Namaskabi. Egam. Inhale. Dui. Exhale. Trini. Inhale. Chaturi back. Pancha inhale. Shut. Exhale. Sapta right foot. Ashta exhale. Nava inhale. Dasha exhale. Eka dasha, left foot. Dua dasha, answer. Try your dasha. Inhale. Chatu dasha. Exhale. Five breath. One. Two. Three. Four. And five. Pancha dasha. Inhale. Chodasha. Exhale. Sata dasha. Inhale. Sama city here. See, it is not so intimidating and challenging when you break it down one by one. Yeah. So the thing is, you need to start somewhere. I start as a beginner and I was actually quite hopeless and I actually tumbling in front of the mat and kind of things, all sorts of things before trying to get into the um, advanced level even before I was ready. So the thing is, I always believe going through so many years through yoga, I've always believed that with consistent practice, you can reach where you are, where you want to be. Yeah. So um, for uh, Sura Namaskar A and B, for beginners, I would suggest that you do five, five rounds each. So um, because this is considered as a warm up for us, so it is very important that you do five rounds each for beginners. Once you are okay, you think that you are better, you are ready to go to the intermediate, after you build up the arm strength, you can go to the intermediate, so you can reduce the uh, Surya Namaskar B from five times to three times. But I would was, I was suggest that you con um, stick to five and three, rather than you know three to three, because sometimes there's no need to rush through your practice, if you but if you really need if you really are advanced already and you really can do without so much warm up 
maybe three times each is really up to you just listen to the body and have fun and always remember um, when you practice practice safely and always remember to have fun namaste See you the next video.